Hello and welcome to BBC News. I'm David Eads. Our top stories. A diplomatic push to avoid war in Ukraine as the US and Russian presidents agree to hold a summit on the deepening crisis. Queen Elizabeth tests positive for the coronavirus. Buckingham Palace says the 95-year-old is experiencing mild symptoms. They're back. International visitors return to Australia as the country opens up to fully vaccinated travellers for the first time in almost two years. Also, the secret to running 100 miles at world record pace and beating all the men in the process. We speak to the American ultra runner and her coach. And after 16 days of competition, the Winter Olympics come to a spectacular close in Beijing. Hello, thanks for joining us. Well, it would appear the groundwork is being laid for a diplomatic summit aimed at avoiding a war in Ukraine. The French pre uh, President Emmanuel Macron has said that both Joe Biden and Vladimir Putin have agreed in principle to meet to discuss the situation. Monsieur Macron's office said that uh, a meeting could only take place if Russia doesn't invade the country. Uh, speaking on US television, the American Secretary of State, Antony Blinken, said that President Biden was prepared to meet Mr Putin 